Hello everybody, Seastake here and welcome back to more Mario Kart Super Circuit. Last time we finished off the Flower Cup Extra and uh, yeah, now we're really gonna get into some difficult uh, courses. I did practice this cup uh, just recently and it did definitely give me quite a bit of uh, trouble. I, I honestly do expect that I'm gonna end up using uh, quite a bit of continues and it doesn't really help that I'm commentating now uh, as opposed to last time when I was practicing without you know commentating because commentating does indeed just make everything a lot harder and I apologize if I get too quiet during this course but Bowser's Castle has a lot of walls where you can crash and yeah you really gotta focus on uh, getting these turns down right Straight away I can use my mushroom here safely. And I got a pretty good lead against Luigi. Oh god! Okay, that wasn't that bad. It could have been a lot worse. And I still and I stole a star from someone. I feel like that was probably Luigi who I stole it from since he's always getting stars. There's a star right here. I don't remember if uh, this Bowser Castle stage has been uh, remaked. Uh, besides, well, in this game, but like for other Mario games, I can't honestly cannot remember. I kind of want to say it was for the 3DS, but I really don't know. And there you go, that was pretty easy. Did have to concentrate quite a bit to pull off all those turns, but thankfully I got first. And on to the next track, which is Mario Circuit 3. I thought it was going to be a different one, but... But we'll get to that right after this. Mario Circuit 3, I believe this stage was, uh... I believe this one was in Mario Kart Wii. Fairly certain it was. God. Just gotta love that rubber banding on the, uh on the uh, computer players. God, Luigi, calm down. Yeah, I cannot wait for uh, 200cc to come out. Like, if anybody ever saw that uh, April 1st Nintendo Direct, and you see the screenshots from uh, the 200cc, it says, it's gonna say so right there on the game that you're gonna be needing to be pretty good at braking, which, uh, braking in Mario Kart is something that you've never really had to do besides just turning around or maybe just for like battle mode and stuff, but when it comes to racing, braking really never did, uh, like help out anybody. I mean, I suppose if you're using like a golden mushroom or something, it, you know, you might have to do it from time to time, but... Man, I honestly can't wait. It's gonna be a pain having to get three, a three-star rank on every a single cup again in 200cc, but you know, hopefully I can do it. Bowser, get out of my way! Okay, good, awesome. Got him. Got myself first place in this uh, track. And now the next one is, uh, I really don't expect to have any problems uh, getting first place in this next track. But we have the introduction of uh, Koopa Beach, or at least for this game. And I like Koopa Beach for a couple different reasons. One of them, you don't really have any walls that can, you know, block you off. You do have, you know, the deep water where you can fall in, but, you know, I might, I'd much rather deal with that than, you know, the walls. 
and I guess the thing that I really like about the Koopa Beach is just the song. I really freaking love the song. It's so good. If it's not a uh, the Rainbow Road song from you know the original Super Mario Kart game, it has to be this song. This song would definitely be my favorite. As you can see, I'm in first place with no real problems. You don't even have to stick to the main course, you can just jump all these gaps here. Wow, not even that didn't even take a minute, that was like 59 seconds, so almost a minute. And uh, thankfully I have 27 points. Uh, which means that I think I could get, I think I could actually get fourth place on this track and still come out with the uh, gold trophy. But yeah, here we have. Uh, ah, damn it, I forgot the name of this. But yeah, we we have one of these tracks again, and yeah, this track definitely did give me trouble when I was uh, practicing it earlier on. Wow, I almost hit the wall there. God damn it, see, that's what I hate, just hitting the wall. I need to be more careful. And that was also a really annoying thing, is uh, when I'm doing my turns, just missing that stupid uh, item block. Because I, I just need to get fourth place. I'm, I'm pretty sure if I get fourth place, I should be good. Okay, got Yoshi. Ah, damn it, Yoshi! Come on, I just want to get fourth place. Okay, gotta start here. No, I don't think I'm gonna do it. I got six. Nope. Well, I'm gonna try one more time on uh, on camera, and then if I can't do it, I think I'm just gonna do this off screen. Yoshi! Somehow I managed to get in third. And just one more lap remaining. Oh my god, it'd be amazing if I somehow managed to get first. However, I doubt that's gonna happen because Bowser has that stupid red tail. Man, he's being slowed down with a boost, so I might still be able to pull this off. I could just time one of these Koopa shows. Ah, damn it. Close. Well. I got a gold trophy, so you know I'm happy with that. But yeah, uh, Coco Island 2, that's what it's called. Yeah, this stage, they also brought this stage back in uh, Mario Kart DS, and I actually really enjoy this stage in that game. And we got a C rank, 79 coins. Did use one continue. But yeah, that was the, uh, I believe that was the Lightning Cup, was it? Yes, that was the Lightning Cup. Just two more cups remaining. 
honestly not really looking forward to Vanilla Lake. Oh my god, Vanilla Lake. Uh, it's not as Vanilla Lake's not gonna be as hard in this game as it is in the original, but still, it's gonna be pretty difficult. And of course, after the Star Cup, we're gonna have finally get to the uh, SNES Rainbow Road. But yeah, anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, and you know I will see you guys in the next part. Later, folks.